disease related to um, connected with the uh, charcoal. It's it's uh, uh, lungs and, and and there's so many people around more than two thousand. 2,000 that die every day, but there's so much that will be six for years. I mean, I'm, I'm telling you, Bobby, I can't sleep without thinking about this. This is why we're, I don't know, they're not afraid of big words, okay, but unstoppable right now because it has, and it started to stop just by a switch of, it's not a paradigm shift. Like, uh, I think it's West that said, the, uh, you mentioned earlier again, it's not a question of cha uh, mind uh, change, not at all. They're doing it already. Alcohol is the second uh, biggest uh, trade ever in, in, in history, you know. They know how to do it. We're just helping them, promoting to, it. To like organize promoting. it into a business so they can feed themselves and save lives. So you're saying 2,000 a day in, 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 throughout the world is quantifiable by the health organization. So if I do quick math, that's about that's 750 odd thousand people a year dying because they're, they're depleting forestry to begin with, environmental issue, and then you got all these pulmonary issue, and then you got direct accidents from fire burning in, you know, especially people using other devices. So you you can solve that it, with it your is. invention. We have, we have a, a real solution right now. Hopefully there'll, there'll be more, but this is a, a real one. <laughs> And, 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 and the idea has evolved tremendously in the last few months. Like, for example, the, the stove. Talk about the little, since people in third world countries, a lot of them still don't have electricity. So if they don't have electricity, they don't have stoves that they can cook. They have to build fires. They don't, certainly don't have refrigeration. But it's amazing to me that some of them have cell phones. <laughs> so t tell us about what, the, the, what you guys have evolved in your thinking as a result of a mastermind session that you had in Tampa recently how you can yes. take that to that next level far beyond just the use of stove yeah thanks again to you because of your networking we met with uh, your friend well uh, our friend now well, I knew I knew Waj but this is why we're focusing Bangladesh in December but we, we we're developing right now and all the, the, the money we can put in for, for R&D our inventor Marco you know has, has stopped and it's it's done right now same burner so while they'll be cooking it's Every day they got a cook, okay? Especially, example, rice. Uh, those countries, Asia, even Madagascar, it has to be rice. I mean, it's, it's centuries, okay? Cooking is a must. While they'll be cooking our little stove right now as a, <laughs> it's like a USB key, believe it or not. We're trying to keep the cost down so it's affordable and re re um, duplicable, okay? So it's a USB key that will, will uh, charge a light. Okay, uh, um, LED light. Okay. okay. The, so people are going to plug this little device into the stove while it's cooking, and it's yeah. going to generate electricity. Like it's going lighting, okay. I should say. Not electricity. I can give a good example. Flying back from uh, Madagascar, you know, like we had a documentary, touching documentary again. Three hundred thousand people in India, especially women, get burned because of light. Oh. They have. Uh, candlelight, it, it turns, it, it brings, uh, it turns the house on fire and all this. We have the same solution right now, but we have to think about a, a concept of taking this uh, heat into little of electricity so it can charge a battery that will run a light. It's done. Okay. So while you do your promotion, and I, I don't know if you've mentioned, but hopefully we'll launch the same time you launch in February. Well, that's a goal. And yeah. This is all functional. So, so yes, so you have a stove that provides not only uh, cooking through ethanol, which is environmentally friendly, no side effect. There'll be a little USB key where people can recharge their cell phone or, or, in, or in electricity. So I'm aware of, you know, so if you can create, if you can put a USB key into a stove to generate lighting, you could recharge a cell phone then. That's two main things because every time we think of, um, of uh, poorest country, and we laugh about uh, several years. It's their only way to communicate. If there's any communication, they don't have hard lines like we right, have right, in right, the right, right. States, Canada. But how do they normally charge their cell phones? You see, you've solved the problem. If they don't have electric electrical device, you just solve a major big problem. Very yeah. cool. Very cool. So, so our goal is to, to through membership, to create a, a a reason for being. Again, a higher consciousness community, knowing that when we bring the music, the artists, the fans. We're taking some of our profits and redirecting your way to finance a stove. So, so how long are these stoves good for? Um, you know, a family. We deliver a stove to a family in a third world country. Oh, right now it's it's over ten years. I think it'll be like thirty years right now. We're trying to put the numbers together for scientists and all this. Yeah. But 
the, the base of the stove is plastic, recyclable plastic, okay? So this is why we thought of almost everything. No, no, no parts that can fail. It's fed by gravity, so they don't need pumps, they don't need electricity, uh, it would be uh, crazy to, okay? So it's, it's very simple technology. So, so that means hey, what well, we need to add to this, just fuel, fuel for thought, we need to create a device that's USB driven that's going to power these little speakers so uh, people can listen to music through, you know, hopefully other type of device like an iPod or, or whatever. Why not? You know, you got music while you're cooking, you got lighting. Bobby, you're artist right now. Exactly the other way around. We're promoting through music because music is our ambassador right now. So watch us. We'll, be, we'll, we'll, we'll access right now 160, 168, all the countries that our um, intellectual property um, Yeah, where you're is, protected. Uh -huh. Yes. So, so the, the artist becomes... Proud, a, the, and, and what we're proud and proud about, really proud about, that's why it's the be best mix right now with your, your program is the, the music of your artists will reach area that will never even thinkable. Never thinkable because we penetrate. We go in area there's not even roads, and they find a way to have some kind of antenna. And and then I'm telling you, it's 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 uh, okay. Music will be our ambassador, and and on our side we'll promote. You'll see, you'll see. It's uh, okay. But no, I'll trust that you got a much bigger picture than I do about it because you've been working on it for five years. So basically, artists have become goodwill ambassador because we're delivering music, we're creating exposure, we're going to bring some musicians in in some remote areas. Um, to, to connect with the people and man oh man that's exciting to me because you know what yeah, I, I think I was doing some research on Live 8 and Live Aid and, and then um, We Are the World and how they leverage music to generate billions of dollars for humanitarian projects and, and that's you know in a nutshell if we can sum it up that's what we're creating here I think so <laughs> yeah it's pretty amazing I, I don't know if it'll be in the billions but it's certainly going to we're going to be able to reach people we've never been able to reach before. Well, Louis, you know, again, thank you for your support, your vision. Um, you've helped me tremendously in the thinking um, coming into the, the launch. I'm, I'm delighted to be part of it. It's all networking. I'm happy that the people, the few people I've, you know, introduced you to are now in a position to help you open countries. That's, that's exciting. And uh, so February, um, February 2012 is your launch. We'll synchronize. Do you have a date in mind? Because we, we, I don't have a date in mind. I know it's February, but do we have? Oh, well, I would we'll say end of February. Okay. Yeah. So, so uh, we mentioned countries. You know, like we were in Mexico City a week, December, Bangladesh, Madagascar. We have to go back. Dominican Republic. We were there a week because of Haiti. Everybody knows Haiti. How they suffer zero trees and all that jazz. So. We need to the end of February. I, I, we don't have a date right now. Just but a tool. Up. You're me now. You gotta stop this right now. We thank you, Melusos, my friend. I mean, it's I don't know how to express it. And 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 well, I always say rock and roll, but I, I gotta it, do now. We gotta it's, find it's, a it's gonna be jazz, rhythm. soul, funk, uh, electronica, hi, soulful hip hop, a little bit of everything. We'll find a term for it. But you all got, right, you already well, have good names, and they're gonna. Big names right now in music. You know, you know already. You yeah, yeah. Some of the people you have access to. We're not going to drop names, but you have access. Yeah, no, some. No, it's, it's there. My no, when when it's done, we'll talk about it instead of talking about it. So no, yeah. and so thank thank Marco, your your partner. Thank Mimi, your partner. Mireille, yeah. Mireille, uh, everybody who's been part of your vision for five years. Look, it's so easy for me to tag on to this. You did all the dirty work. You did all the research. You put all the sweat equity. You put all the money. You put all the time. You put all the energy five years and all we need to do now is help promote what you're doing and bridge it to what we're doing man i'll tell you it's, it's a dream come true for for an organization like ours so i'm grateful i'm thankful and uh we'll be chatting real soon and uh, louis thank you for, so much for taking the time your precious valuable time that you have with your lovely bride to do the call today <laughs> because you don't see her too yeah. often <laughs> yeah thank you bobby and all right my bobby. man i will talk to you soon my friend you got it okay and enjoy. You got to believe it. Yes. Bye. Yeah. Ciao, man. We're in conversation uh, for oh, the last 30 minutes with uh, Louis Farrin from Miluso. So uh, that's the humanitarian project. It's not a nonprofit organization. It is for profit. But um, you'll, you'll get to know a whole lot more, um, a little bit every week as we as we um, keep moving the engine forward. So I'm gonna play the next, uh, we're gonna wrap up the show on the, on the babbling side, I think, in a few minutes. I'm gonna play, uh, uh, we got lots of music. I'm gonna be online for probably another hour just playing music. Um, 
I'm going to recap the show. Uh, I'm going to give you, um, some of you want to know about uh, what to do if you want a, uh, to become a free member. We'll call them a gold member. And then for the uh, independent artists, you, you can become a charter member like Ambu Keeley and Westbound and get tremendous amount of perks. And, and I'll tell you how you do that. And I'll tell you what's in it for you. And, um, you know, um, it's, it's hard to organize uh, this much excitement in just a few hours. I, I knew, I knew we'd be an extended show today. But every sat Saturday will be one hour. I'm going to stick to one hour starting next Saturday, 9 Eastern. And um, pretty simple, one hour. All right. Um, so while the music is playing, I'm going to go and look at the emails. And we're going to find a winner for the uh, Costa Rica vacation giveaway. And uh, we'll be announcing that. So uh, stay tuned. And uh, let me see now. Let me see. I, I got to find uh, our next tune, right? Our next uh, triad mix uh, featuring the music of um, Tony Exum Jr. and Bukile, which you met um, uh, earlier, right? And, uh, and also with, uh, hey, we're going to have Joe Yander again. So from, um, so hang on a minute, because it's not easy to talk live, to bring the cameras in. I don't have anybody cueing the music for me, all right? And I, not that I want to. And, um, but here's the music. We'll be back in nine minutes and 30 seconds, and we'll announce the winner of the Costa Rica vacation package. Then we'll wrap up the show, and then we'll still stream the music, because I got a lot of indie artists to promote for the balance of um, the after well, the balance of the afternoon, the balance of my morning. All right, so enjoy that, okay? Triad. Mix 41 on PromoteTheMusic.com with Bobby D. Thank you. 